Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Lena and I was talking about doing this video for some time and finally here it is. Today we're going to talk about fall and early winter outfit formula. So let's jump right in. But really quick, just before I start, I want to say thank you to Ana Luisa, which this video made in collaboration with. Ana Luisa is a jewelry brand with idea in mind that high quality jewelry shouldn't cost a planet. All of their jewelry pieces are ethically produced and 100% carbon and water neutral. They're using recycled materials as much as possible and overall really open about all steps of production processes, setting a new standard of accountability for the jewelry industry. Ana Luisa truly is the jewelry you can feel good about wearing. It's not the first time I'm collabing with them and once again I'm more than happy to support ethical brands. I'm more than happy to share it with you because I'm in love with some of their jewelry pieces. The one thing that I got just recently is this beautiful little hoop earrings. They're called Paris and it's funny because they look like just little croissants. You also can often see me wearing a lot of their chunky rings on my other videos or on my Instagram. One thing I noticed about Annalisa jewelry, it has really unique plating color. It's not super yellow, more like a subtle gold color that definitely makes it look more elegant. Overall, they have such a beautiful, minimalistic, sophisticated pieces, so they can be a nice present for yourself or for someone you love. Considering this holiday season is almost here, so I definitely recommend you to go and check them out. They're also running their biggest sale of the year right now, so you can get 20% off sidewise, so go find the link down in the description box. And back to the title of this video, what actually is the outfit formula? Formula is this pre-made outfit schema where little details or elements in the final look can be slightly different, but all the looks created using this schema will maintain the same structure. So for example, simple formula can be white t-shirt, blazer, jeans and ankle boots. As you can see here, you can choose yourself what exact blazer or boots you like more and it will be different outfits at the end but you still will be staying within this given formula. I will try to be more specific about details like styles, cuts, fabrics because when you talk about formulas it's really easy to fall into pure abstraction. Keeping the schemas in the back of your mind really can help you to save some time when you put in together an outfit in the morning. And by the way, all the formulas I'm going to talk about today I gathered in one post on my Instagram. So if you will like this video, you can find a link to this post down below and you can save it and use it when you like Oh, I have nothing to wear. I don't know what to wear. You can just open your savings on Instagram and just go through these little collages that I pre-made for you. So, hope you like it and let's start. So, the first formula will be blue jeans, white t-shirt and leather jacket. Since I'm wearing something like this right now, you probably can guess this is one of my favorite formula for fall season. You can create it completely from your base pieces and almost any shoes can work here. It can be classic white sneakers or black ankle boots. And this formula is also a perfect canvas if you want to add some accent details, maybe wear some trendy or interesting shoes or maybe bring a pop of color with some bright bag. And for this formula we'll need this structured blazer type leather jacket and of course you can wear any different type of jacket but as you can see right here it will be a different outfit with completely different mode. The next formula will be black leggings with sneakers, trench coat and baseball hat and I'm not specifying first layer here it can be almost anything hoodie maybe sweatshirt 
t-shirt, long sleeve. It depends more on weather condition outside and personal preferences. If you watch my channel, you already know that baseball hats definitely have their moment this year. But if you want to keep up with trends even more here, you can go for leggings with side or front cuts. They also work nice with proportions, stretching the legs and silhouette in general. Also, it can be a stirrup leggings. This trend definitely won't be here for long, so if you like it, this is the right time to wear it. And another way to add a trendy element here can be by wearing long white socks that overlap the leggings. But this one can be tricky because it creates this horizontal lines and visually just cut your legs so it can look not so flattering on some people so just keep that in mind the next formula will be mini skirt with some oversized top it can be sweater or sweatshirt plus chunky lug sole boots Boots here can be ankle length or just below the knee here we're pairing the mini on the bottom with something oversized and loose fitted on top to get this well-balanced look. Here is also one little hack that I can give you if you don't really like to wear mini but still want to try it. You can wear it with some long coat, wool one or trench coat and it will give you enough coverage and comfort to explore this new style and just get used to it. Next formula will be with this currently super popular Chanel-like tweed jacket. A lot of people love it, but don't really know, not sure how to style it. For this formula, we will need the jacket itself, obviously. For the first layer, it should be some basic piece like white t-shirt or long sleeve. And for the long sleeve, it can be one plain solid color, but also it will be super interesting if you will add this Parisian style stripe one. Next we have blue jeans and some white sneakers. And for extra trendy look you also can add a baseball hat on top but this outfit will be complete even without baseball hat so it's completely optional. The next formula we have today is sweatpants, t-shirt or tank top and classic blazer. Sweatpants base here they're a huge part of the outfit, they're pop out, they're noticeable and it's clearly a sport element so we need to balance this sport part with something classic and feminine, elegant and at the end it's still look with sweatpants so it's just extremely comfortable and if blazer is not enough because the weather is too cold you can easily switch it to some structured wool coat for the next formula, we will need classic suit, white t-shirt or turtleneck and some flats. The schema is so great, so chic, but simple and easy to do. As you can see, we take this super office dress coat thing as a suit and pair it with more casual elements. For the first layer, it can be this solid color turtleneck or simple t-shirt. And for the shoes, it can be sneakers, for example, or some simple loafers. Basically here, since the suit is so formal, we need to dress it down with all other elements. And suit here can be more tailored, but at the same time, it can be more masculine, oversized. Here, it's totally up to you. The next formula will be straight jeans, button up chunky loafers or derby shoes and knit sweater but we're going to wear it on the shoulders here is the great example how we can create this interesting multi-layered outfit from super simple basic pieces and if you need to add another layer here we can choose classic trench coat sweaters on the shoulders over some outwear really interesting and easy to do fashion trick it looks elegant but kind of effortless at the same time and last but not least for today will be the knit set and it's such a broad concept so for today's video i ended up with knit skirt some matching one sleeve short and flats or ankle boots and for colder weather, we're also adding some structured coat on top. 
Knitwear extremely popular and wearing prepared sets is the easiest way to look put together and dressed up without thinking too much about it. But you also can just find individual pieces in matching color and just throw them together. Knitwear also is a super universal thing, perfect for people who want to look feminine but still wear something comfortable. And here fits can vary. You can go for more skin tight versions or for more oversized ones. Once again, here it's totally up to you and your comfort zone. So that was all for today. I really hope it was helpful. And if you want to see similar video, but for more deep cold winter season, let me know in the comments because I live in Texas now, but I'm Russian, so I know the struggle when you during the winter and you want to look stylish, you want to look cute, but you don't want to freeze to death. I got you. Struggle is real. And um, definitely let me know if you would like to see this video. And also don't forget to check out the description to find this beautiful jewelry pieces from Ana Luisa. Remember, if you order now, you will get 20% off entire website. So don't miss it out. Anyway, I hope you'll have an amazing week and I'll see you guys in the next one.